So here's the latest. Uh, the days to ROI actually includes uh, the impact of the BTC block reward happening. So for example, if it says the ROI is 308 days, uh, then it's still 381 days away from the happening. So that doesn't get impacted. So for example, this is assuming that the difficulty and the price of Bitcoin remain the same every day for the next 308 days. And if that's the case, then this miner with these specs and this price and that a recurring cost will ROI in 308 days. This column here assumes that the price of Bitcoin will increase by 1% and so that the number of days it takes to ROI reduces a little bit. Now this one here assumes that the difficulty is increasing by 5%. So you could see what a 5% monthly increase looks like on the ROI uh, using these calculations here. So that's 5% there. Now we could say 4%, we could say 3%. If the halvening is considered, then it automatically calculates this out here because 915 days is longer than 381 days. It automatically takes the halvening of the block reward and it, it cuts it in half. And the same as here right now, but obviously this isn't going to take effect until at least 364 days until the happening. So there's still maybe a month or so until the data here is impacted by the happening. But this data right here is already including the 6.25 block reward after this date.